accounting for debenture when any company is need of is in need of fund or finance apart from issuing equity share or preference share it can borrow money from general public in form of loan on which company will pay interest at regular time interval at pre decided rate so this is called borrowed fund or you can say it is form of long term borrowing for the company which is shown in the balance sheet under the head non current liability so debenture is basically an instrument which will acknowledge debt of the company company has borrowed money from the general people on which company will pay regular inter uh, regular interest at regular time interval and after completion of certain time the money the principal borrowed will be refunded so the person who are making investment in debenture are called debenture holders so debenture holders are just like creditors for the company they don't have any decision making power or ownership stake in the business they don't have any voting power they are just concerned with the regular payment of their interest and timely refund of their capital so debenture is a long term borrowing non current liability for the company debenture is a document that confirms the debt of company and its acknowledgement of debt debentures are also known as bonds what we are referring to debenture in india in us it is known as bonds bonds are form of debenture generally issued by government or government company for certain project now debenture is a document relating to money lent or given as a loan to the company debenture is a security that bears a fixed rate of interest on which interest is payable on a predetermined date means whether company has earned profit or loss interest on debenture has to be paid it is expense for the company so doesn't matter whether company has made profit or loss the interest on debenture will have to be paid the interest on debenture is payable at fixed rate each and every debenture will be counted up with predetermined rate of interest like 8% debenture 9% debenture 10% debenture debenture are issued for a fixed term say for 5 year 10 year 15 year the comp on completion of this term the money on debenture will have to be refunded no company is allowed to issue debenture having maturity of more than 10 years from the date of issue as per companies act 2030 so maximum period for the debenture can be issued or money can be borrowed by issuing debenture is 10 years a company engaged in infrastructure project can issue debenture for more than 10 years but not exceeding 30 years the like infrastructure project ke company consider karti hoy jem ke lnt che barabar je who are build, uh, building bridges dam road canal metro so for them maximum time period is 10 years debenture can be issued with or without charge or asset so debenture will be given security when assets of the company are mortgaged against debenture hypothecation is created charge is created means if company will make default in payment of debenture money the debenture holder can sell the asset and realize their money Debenture are generally listed on stock exchange after the issue of thereof, and purchase or sale of debenture are traded at the stock exchange like shares. If the terms of debenture so provide, debenture can be converted into shares. Debenture are shown as long-term borrowing under the heading non-current liability or equity and liability side of balance sheet. Debenture don't have any voting right. Debentures cannot be forfeited if any debenture holder does not pay money. in the event of liquidation of company first debenture holder will be paid money then after words if anything remains equity share holder will be paid now types of debenture on the basis of security secured or mortgage debenture when company is creating charge or making mortgage on asset against issue of debenture they are called secured debenture means creating charge floating charge means company can use the asset but company cannot sell off such asset for example company has issued 10 crore worth rupees of debenture against which company has mortgaged its office building of 12 crore 
if company will make default in payment of debenture money the debenture holder have a right to sell off the building and realize their money that is called mortgage or secure debenture debenture can be first mortgage second mortgage suppose building is worth rupees 12 crore and first of all debenture have been issued for 5 crore then first issued debenture are having first mortgage then if other debenture are issued they will have second right second mortgage on debenture they will have second claim after realizing or after making payment of first claim debenture first mortgage debenture then unsecured simple or naked debenture such debenture are issued without any security or charge generally company having high prestige in the market blue chip company having high goodwill and prestige in the market debenture will be issued like this unsecured simple or naked against such debenture company is not putting any asset for mortgage so if company will make any default in payment of debenture money the debenture holder will not have any advantage they are like unsecured creditors then as per the negotiability and procedure for redemption registered debenture the debenture which are registered under the name of the person who has borrowed who has lent money to the company are known as debenture holder company will make an entry in the register maintained for debenture holder in such a register the name of the person who has bought the debenture is mentioned they are called registered debenture it can be purchased in the name of the person who have made investment and there are debenture means these debenture are not registered in name of any particular person they can be easily transferred to one person from one person to another they are easily negotiable Bravo. so company will may not make any entry regarding the name of the person who have purchased the debenture they are like currency notes and can be transferred easily nearby delivery then as per the condition of redemption redemption means repayment so redeemable debenture or irredeemable debenture the debenture which are issued with the condition that the amount of debenture will be redeemed or refunded after a certain time period they are called redeemable debenture the debenture money can be refunded at a time in lump sum or by installment or at a stretch once in a while then perpetual or irredeemable debenture irredeemable debentures are those debentures which are not repaid their money unless and until company goes into liquidation but generally these type of debenture are not found in india then convertible debenture the debenture holder when given option after certain time period whether they want to get converted into equity share or not then such type of debenture are known as convertible debenture earlier the law was that that company can easily convert the debenture at their own but afterwards there was an amendment in companies act under which debenture can be convertible into equity share at the option of debenture holder when debenture holder wants to get converted then and then company can transform them into equity share these type of debenture can be partly or fully fully convertible debenture means the whole amount will be transformed into equity share or converted into equity share partly convertible means suppose part of the value suppose 100 rupees debenture against which 40 rupees of equity share will be given and 60 rupees will be continued as a debenture okay how can the 80s ma late 80s ma reliance industry a avay the convertible debenture issue kare e feri o law na to ke debenture holder ne puchwa એટલે પહેલા ડિબેન્ચર ઇશ્યુ કર્યા હવે ડિબેન્ચર ઇશ્યુ કર્યા કંપનીએ એટલે કંપનીએ ઇન્ટરેસ્ટ પે કરવું પડે અને ડિબેન્ચરના પૈસા પાછા આપવા પડે એટલે લોકો ઇન્ટરેસ્ટ ની લાલચમાં ડિબેન્ચરમાં ઇન્વેસ્ટમેન્ટ કર્યું રિલાયન્સ ઇન્ડસ્ટ્રી રાતો રાત એમ ઇક્વિટી શેરમાં કન્વર્ટ કરી દીધા એટલે કંપનીને શું બેનિફિટ એ તો પૈસા પાછા નહીં આપવાના ઇન્ટરેસ્ટ રેગ્યુલર પેમેન્ટ નહીં કરવાનો અને કહેવાય શું કે તમને ઓનર બનાવી દીધા અને ડિવિડન્ડ કંપની ડિક્લેર કરે તો જ મળે એટલે બહુ મોટો સ્કેમ હતો કે પૈસા પાછા ના આપવા પડે લોકોના પછી ગવર્મેન્ટ એવો લો લાઈ એવો કાયદો લાઈ કે ભાઈ ડિબેન્ચર કેન બી કન્વર્ટેડ ઇન્ટુ ઇક્વિટી શેર એટ ધ ઓપ્શન ઓફ ડિબેન્ચર હોલ્ડર એટલે ડિબેન્ચર હોલ્ડરને પહેલા પૂછવાનું કે ભાઈ તમારે ઇક્વિટીમાં કન્વર્ટ થવું છે ધેન એન્ડ ધેન કંપની કેન કન્વર્ટ ધેમ ઇન્ટુ ડિબેન્ચર નોટ બાય ધેર ઓન હે હા નોન કન્વર્ટેબલ ડિબેન્ચર such debenture cannot be converted into equity share or in any other security 
બરાબર ડિબેન્ચર ની ઇશ્યુ પ્રોસીજર સેમ ફ્રી ઇક્વિટી શેર ની જેમ પણ ડિબેન્ચર કેન બી ઇશ્યુડ એટ પાર એન્ડ 100 રૂપિયા સો ડિબેન્ચર 100 રૂપિયા થી એટ પ્રીમિયમ ધેટ ઇઝ 100 રૂપિયા સો ડિબેન્ચર 120 થી ઓર એટ ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ 100 રૂપિયા સો ડિબેન્ચર 95 શેર્સ ખાલી એટ પાર ને પ્રીમિયમ જ ઇશ્યુ થાય બટ ડિબેન્ચર કેન બી ઇશ્યુડ આધર એટ પાર એટ પ્રીમિયમ ઓર એટ ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ હવે ની જે એન્ટ્રી છે એ સેમ શેર્સ ની જેમ પણ જ્યાં જ્યાં તમે ઇક્વિટી શેર લખતા હતા ત્યાં ત્યાં ડિબેન્ચર લખવા ધ બેંક ટુ ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન ટુ ડિબેન્ચર ડિબેન્ચર અલોટમેન્ટ ટુ ડિબેન્ચર બેંક ટુ ડિબેન્ચર અલોટમેન્ટ ડિબેન્ચર કોલ ટુ ડિબેન્ચર અને બેંક ટુ ડિબેન્ચર કોલ એટલે જ્યાં જ્યાં ઇક્વિટી શેર આવતું હતું ત્યાં ત્યાં ડિબેન્ચર આવ્યું એપ્લિકેશન વે રિસીવ ફોર 10000 ડિબેન્ચર આફ્ટર અલોટમેન્ટ ઓફ 8000 ડિબેન્ચર રિજેક્ટેડ એક્સેસ એપ્લિકેશન એન્ડ રિફંડેડ મની ટુ એપ્લિકન્ટ ઓલ ધ અમાઉન્ટ યુ ઓન અલોટમેન્ટ એન્ડ કોલ બે ડ્યુલી રિસીવ સો પહેલી એન્ટ્રી આવશે બેંક ટુ 8% ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન 10000 ઇન્ટુ 30 ધેન 8% ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન ટુ 8% ડિબેન્ચર ટુ બેંક 3 લાખ ટુ 40 ધેટ ઇઝ 80000 ઇન્ટુ 8000 ઇન્ટુ 30 અને જે એક્સેસ છે 2000 ઇન્ટુ 30 ધેટ વિલ બી રિફંડેડ ધેટ વિલ બી ક્રેડિટ ટુ બેંક ધેન 8% ડિબેન્ચર અલોટમેન્ટ ટુ 8% ડિબેન્ચર 8000 ઇન્ટુ 40 બેંક ટુ ડિબેન્ચર અલોટમેન્ટ 320 320 ધેન 8% ડિબેન્ચર કોલ ટુ ડિબેન્ચર 8000 ઇન્ટુ 30 અને બેંક ટુ 8% ડિબેન્ચર કોલ ધેટ ઇઝ 8000 ઇન્ટુ 30 ઓકે એવી રીતે ડિબેન્ચર કેન બી ઇશ્યુડ એટ પ્રીમિયમ જેવી રીતે શેર્સ માં પ્રીમિયમ હોય એવી રીતે ડિબેન્ચર માં બી પ્રીમિયમ હોય બરાબર જેમ આપણે શેર માં ક્રેડિટ કરીએ છે પ્રીમિયમ એ રીતે ડિબેન્ચર માં બી પ્રીમિયમ ક્રેડિટ થાય એને ટુ સિક્યોરિટી પ્રીમિયમ રિઝર્વ સી અ કંપની ઇશ્યુ 6000 10% ડિબેન્ચર ઓફ 100 ડિચ એટ અ પ્રીમિયમ ઓફ 20 પર ડિબેન્ચર ફૂલ અમાઉન્ટ ઓફ ડિબેન્ચર વોઝ કોલ્ડ અપ ઓન એપ્લિકેશન સો બેંક ટુ 10% ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન એન્ડ અલોટમેન્ટ જ્યારે ભેગો મંગાવે ત્યારે બધા પૈસા એપ્લિકેશન ટાઈમે જ આવી જાય તેને 10% ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન અલોટમેન્ટ કહેવાય તો 6000 એક ડિબેન્ચર 120 રૂપિયા છે એમાં 100 રૂપિયા કેપિટલ ને 20 પ્રીમિયમ સો બેંક ટુ 10% ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન એન્ડ અલોટમેન્ટ અને ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન એન્ડ અલોટમેન્ટ ટુ 10% ડિબેન્ચર ટુ સિક્યોરિટી પ્રીમિયમ 6000 200 ડિબેન્ચર માં અને 6000 20 ધેટ ઇઝ 1 લેખ 20000 વિલ બી ક્રેડિટ ટુ સિક્યોરિટી પ્રીમિયમ રિઝર્વ ક્લિયર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ ગમે તેનું ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ કંપની ઓફર કરી શકે ઇફ ધેર ઇઝ નો ક્લેરિફિકેશન ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ ઓન ડિબેન્ચર ઇઝ રેકોર્ડેડ એટ ધ ટાઈમ ઓફ ડિબેન્ચર અલોટમેન્ટ એટલે કે ના કીધું તો ડિબેન્ચર ક્યારે ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ ક્યારે કન્સિડર કરવાનો અલોટમેન્ટ ના ટાઈમ પર ડિબેન્ચર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ ઓર લોસ ઓન ઇશ્યુ ઓફ ડિબેન્ચર ઇઝ શોન ઇન બેલેન્સ શીટ ડિબેન્ચર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ અમાઉન્ટ ઇઝ શોન અંડર ધ ડિફરન્ટ હેડ વિચ ડિપેન્ડ ઓન ટર્મ્સ ઓફ ડિબેન્ચર જનરલી ડિબેન્ચર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ આર શોન અંડર ધ હેડ નોન કરન્ટ અસેટ એન્ડ સબ હેડ નોન અને અધર નોન કરન્ટ અસેટ ડિબેન્ચર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ બરાબર ડિબેન્ચર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ ઓર લોસ ઓન ઇશ્યુ ઓફ ડિબેન્ચર ઇઝ કેપિટલ લોસ એન્ડ ઇટ શુડ બી રિટર્ન ઓફ એઝ અર્લી એઝ પોસિબલ ઇફ ડિબેન્ચર ઇશ્યુ વિથ અ ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ વિથ અ કન્ડિશન ધેટ ડિબેન્ચર આર ટુ બી રીડિંગ આફ્ટર 6 ઇયર્સ તો જે ટુ બી ડિબેન્ચર નો ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ હોય એ એવરી ઇયર 1/6 અમાઉન્ટ રાઈટ ઓફ કરવા ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ છે 
ને તો શું થાય કે ફર્સ્ટ યર માં તમે કરી નાખો એટલો પ્રોફિટ તમારો બહુ ઓછો થઈ જાય એટલે જેટલા ટાઈમ તમે ડિબેન્ચર યુઝ કરો છો એટલા ટાઈમ પીરિયડ માં ડિબેન્ચર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ રાઈટ ઓફ કરો એટલે ફર્સ્ટ યર માં ડિબેન્ચર તમે 6 લાખ રૂપિસ નું ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ દે તો બેલેન્સ શીટ માં 6 લાખ બતાવવાનું પછી એને રાઈટ ઓફ કરો એટલે 1 ફિફ 1/6 અમાઉન્ટ રાઈટ ઓફ કરો એટલે 1 લાખ પીએલ માં ડેબિટ થાય અને 5 લાખ બેલેન્સ શીટ માં બતાવવાનું પછી નેક્સ્ટ યર 1 લાખ બીજા ડેબિટ થાય પીએલ માં અને બેલેન્સ શીટ માં 4 લાખ બતાવવાનું એ રીતે નાઉ ડિબેન્ચર ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ કેન બી રિટર્ન ઓફ અગેન્સ્ટ ધ બેલેન્સ ઓફ સિક્યોરિટી પ્રીમિયમ ઓર ઇટ વિલ બી ડેબિટેડ ટુ પીએલ અકાઉન્ટ સો એન્ટ્રી વિલ બી સિક્યોરિટી પ્રીમિયમ રિઝર્વ ઓર statement of profit or loss to discount on debenture or to loss on issue of debenture a company issued 2008% debenture of 100 each at a price of 80 per debenture on which full amount was called up and same was received the 100 rupees of debenture it is issued and the amount received will be bank to debenture application and allotment 2000 into 80 1,60,000 now debenture application and allotment discount on issue of debenture to 8% debenture debenture ma credit kelu thase 2000 into 100 face value barabar application and allotment ma debit thase 8000 are 2000 into 80 ane per debenture 20 rupees se discount je that will be debited to discount on debenture or debenture discount account clear yes sir राजकोट ऑइल मिल लिमिटेड इश्यूड एट थाउजेंड टेनिटेडर हंड्रेड रूपीज ना डिवेन्चर एटी रूपीज पर डिवेन्चर डिस्काउंट अरे टेन रूपीज पर डिवेन्चर डिस्काउंट तो अलॉटमेंट में आफ्टर डिस्काउंट है डिस्काउंट कंसिडर कर फिफ्टी माइनस टेन अलॉटमेंट में कैपिटल 50 माइनस 10 रुपीस डिस्काउंट इतने 40 आए प्रीमियम में अपने ऐड करता था डिस्काउंट में माइनस करो कंपनी रिसीव्ड एप्लीकेशन फॉर 8000 डिवेंचर कंपनी रिसीव फुल मनी ऑन अलॉटमेंट एक्सेप्ट ऑन 300 चेंज द कंपनी रिसीव फुल अमाउंट यू ऑन कॉट तो फर्स्ट एंट्री बैंक टू डिवेंचर एप्लीकेशन 8000 30 240000 240000 like પછી 10% ડિબેન્ચર એપ્લિકેશન ટુ 10% ડિબેન્ચર 240 240 ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ શુડ બી કન્સિડર એટ ધ ટાઈમ ઓફ અલોટમેન્ટ ઇઝ સ્પેસિફાઈડ સો 10% ડિબેન્ચર અલોટમેન્ટ ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ ઓન ડિબેન્ચર ટુ 10% ડિબેન્ચર એટલે હવે 8000 50 એ અલોટમેન્ટ માં અને ડિબેન્ચર માં ક્રેડિટ થશે અલોટમેન્ટ મની કેટલા થશે 8000 40 અને 10 રૂપિસ ડિસ્કાઉન્ટ માં ડેબિટ થશે 8000 into 10. પછી આવશે બેંક ટુ ડિબેન્ચર અલોટમેન્ટ 320 320. ધેન ડિબેન્ચર ફાઇનલ કોલ ટુ ડિબેન્ચર 8000 into 20 160 160. બેંક અકાઉન્ટ ડેબિટેડ કોલ ઇન એરિયાસ અને 10% ડિબેન્ચર. સો કોલ ઇન એરિયાસ કેલુ 300 ડિબેન્ચર ઉપર 20 રૂપિસ. સો 6000 વિલ કોલ ઇન એરિયાસ ઓવર લેક 54000 વિલ બી અમાઉન્ટ રિસીવ્ડ ઓન કોલ. illustration 7 ankush limited of amreli issued 5009% debenture of 100 each at a discount of 10% on 142017 money was payable as under 20 25 rupees on application 25 on allotment and balance amount on final call application were received for 5000 debenture and allotment was made All money due on debenture were duly received. Expense on issue of debenture amounted to sixteen thousand. Directors decided to write off one fifth amount on expense on issue and discount on debenture from statement of profit and loss each year. Write journal entries for first year only. 
for the from the above transaction in books of thumb. Try to understand. Hundred rupees no difference on the ten percent discount the issue kar raha hai. Ten rupees discount. The issue kitna ho kar raha hai? Ninety rupees. Am I okay? On application twenty five. On allotment. 25 and balance on call the total company is going to receive 90 so 40 rupees will be called upon call if nothing is specified debenture discount will be considered at the time of allotment so it will be 35 minus 10 35 rupees capital debenture will be 10% portion discount now only take a job in the day job of now for the first year me and pick it in the first bank account debited Debenture application five thousand into twenty five. Simply instead of share, you have to write debenture. What will do the as it is? But percentage of the other is called compulsory. This percentage will show the interest to be paid on debenture.
Now, it is further said the directors of the company decided to write off one fifth amount of expense and one fifth amount of debenture discount from the statement of profit and loss account. So, at the end of the year, you have to debit this expense and discount to profit and loss account. So every year company has decided to write off one fifth amount. So sixteen thousand na one fifth. Debenture discount to fifty thousand. And a one fifth. So thirty two hundred and ten thousand. So every year company will write off this. So at the end of every year this entry will be passed. Mm -hmm. So at the end of first year in balance sheet on asset side under non-current asset and under subheading of other current asset expense on issue of debenture will be shown as 16,000 minus 3200 that is 12,800 and debenture discount will be shown as 50,000 minus 10,000 that is 40,000. Okay. Clear?
Now, issue of debenture for consideration rather than cash. Sometimes company will issue debenture for consideration rather than cash. Generally, company will issue debenture when they are in need of money. But sometimes when company is purchasing business of other company, company is purchasing any asset, against that instead of making payment in cash, company will give debenture. So these are called issue of debenture for consideration other than cash. So when any business is purchased, so entry will be sundry asset to sundry liability to enter. You know, equity share in chapter my last last illustration of the 19. Here it is. So sundry asset to sundry liability to vendor and vendors to debenture. When any asset is purchased by issuing debenture, then entry will be asset to vendor and vendor to debenture. See. Mansi Limited purchased machinery worth rupees 6 lakh from Sumer Manufacturing Limited on 1 12 2017. 2 lakh were paid immediately and balance was paid by an issue of 3 lakh 70,000 11% debenture in Mansi. Past necessary journal entries in books of Mansi Limited. company has purchased machinery. From whom company has purchased Sumer Manufacturing. So they are vendor. So machinery account debited to Sumer Manufacturing Limited. Now, out of this 6 lakh, 2 lakh were paid by company immediately. So, And for balance amount, that is for 4 lakh, company has issued debenture worth rupees 370. So, 6 lakh ni asset purchase kari, and he summer company a 2 lakh immediately pay kar jira check thi. So, for remaining 4 lakh, company has, had issued debenture worth rupees 370. And actually, company na bare bit kar. 4 lakh ni address work inu payment kari. 370. So, the benefit thayo, the gain thayo, that will be credited to security premium reserve. So, entry will be Summan Manufacturing Limited Account Debited to Eleven percent debenture to security premium reason against four lakh six made two payment kar diye jole four lakh and samay three seventy na debenture issue karay so thirty thousand will be your premium. ओके और तो मैं बस इसे पीजी लाइन की दी जाए कि इफ बैलेंस विल बी पेड बाय इश्यू ऑफ़ फोर लाख ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड डिवेंचर ले अगेंस्ट फोर लाख रुपीस इफ कंपनी इस पेइंग फोर लाख ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड रुपीस डिवेंचर देन व्हाट विल बी द एंट्री लास्ट एंट्री चेंज था सर बराबर कि इंस्टेड ऑफ then what will be the entry? So here against 4 lakh company is paying debenture worth rupees 420. So 20 rupees is basically lost for company. So that will be treated as discount. 
So I will be one manufacturing. Limited account debited discount on the venture account debited to eleven percent debenture company issuing debenture worth rupees four twenty. Against the amount payable of four lakhs, so twenty thousand is discount. Clear? Mm. Yeah. I had lost that you know debit. Tell you na discount ma. Illustration 9. Nitin Metals Limited purchased assets worth rupees 880,000 and also took over liability that is creditor of 160,000 of Patel Traders. Decided to pay a purchase consideration of 768,000. Nitin Metal paid the purchase consideration by issuing 12% debenture of 100 each at a premium of 20%. नहीं है असेट के लिए परचेस करी एट लेक एट्टी थाउन सामे लाया मेरी वन लेक सिक्स्टी थाउन so, this is your net asset. Purchase consideration. Company is paying seven lakh sixty-eight thousand in form of debenture. So when purchase consideration is higher than net asset, the difference is good. Way. That is forty-eight thousand purchase consideration minus net asset. So purchase consideration of company debenture up as a hundred rupees no debenture twenty rupees twenty percent twenty rupees premium eight debenture one twenty so basically so does it seven lakh sixty eight thousand divide by one twenty it's a number of debenture issue was seven sixty eight divide by 120 6400 rupees na Purchase for okay. so assets account debited. Goodwill account debited.
creditors account and two vendors two hotel traders so company is purchasing a set of 880 goodwill comes at 48000 creditors 160 And we can just issue what seven sixty eight. That is your purchase consideration. Now, company is issuing debentures at premium of twenty per debenture. So, for the debentures account debited. percent debenture 2 security premium reserve total amount payable is 768000 in 200 6400 into 20 rupees premium 640000 and 120 then issue of debenture as collateral security when company takes a loan from bank or from some other party company may have to issue debenture as a subsidiary or secondary security that is called collateral if the asset which have been mortgaged are insufficient then the lender will sell the debenture which have been mortgaged they are called debenture issued as collateral security if the company repays its due to bank in right time bank will return the debenture but if the company will fails to pay the loan the bank will sell the debenture and will realize their money so now how accounting effect will be given so basically there are two methods debenture given to bank as a collateral security are only for the safety of loan so no entry will be passed only in the balance sheet it will be shown as long term borrowing under the main heading non current liability it will be specified that debenture issued as collateral security and second method is you have to write entry that is debenture suspense account debited to debenture So in exam you have to specify both as per first method as per second method. So illustration ten. Company had fourteen lakh rupees issued ten percent debenture on first April two thousand seventeen. That lakh debenture already issued correct. During the year company took a loan of three lakh from bank as on fifteenth July two thousand seventeen. Against this company issued new eleven percent debenture of two lakh as collateral security. Past journal entries under both the methods from the above transaction in book of the company show the details about debenture and bank loan in company in balance sheet. So first method, whenever we are taking loan, entry will be bank to bank loan, three lakh, three lakh. And in balance sheet, on liability side, it will be like that: equity and liability, shareholders fund deal, non-current liability, and long-term borrowing, eleven percent debenture. So already debenture के लिए issue करें जे 14 lakh okay 11 percent debenture okay and bank loan for 11 percent debenture में लखवान above this debenture of 2 lakh issued as collateral security ये खाली security तरी के बाद आपने आपे आ गए इलाय रे issue में include नहीं करवाना 16 lakh नहीं बतावाना 14 lakh तो बतावाना पर bracket में लखवान के 2 lakh rupees debenture issued as collateral security मतलब bank loan 3 lakh नहीं हमें लिखा हुआ है डिबेंचर्स ऑफ टू लैक एस कोलेटरल सिक्योरिटी अब एस पर सेकंड मेथड तो एंट्री विल बी बैंक टू बैंक लोन ये तो नॉर्मल और इस हम अभी जी एंट्री दर्शन डिबेंचर सस्पेंस टू इलेवन परसेंट डिबेंचर ओके और ना बैलेंस शीट में बताओ आनु इलेवन परसेंट डिबेंचर इश्यूड एस कोलेटरल सिक्योरिटी 
अलग थी टू लेक और माइनस डिबेंचर सस्पेंस अल्टीमेटली तो बताओ बता दी पर आर इतना सेपरेट करें इलेवन परसेंट डिबेंचर जो ऑलरेडी फोर्टी लेक ने इश्यू करा दे बताया प्लस एडिशनल इलेवन परसेंट डिबेंचर इश्यू डेस कोलेटर इनर कॉलम में बताओ और टू लेक माइनस डिबेंचर सस्पेंस अकाउंट टू लेक 